So, what are we looking for out here? Well, the map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. I see some ruins up ahead. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Nick. Wait As here. always, you can call me Touch Ninja, and I cannot find a good place to do my intro because they keep talking. But we are once again back playing some Uncharted oh, 4, A Thief's Still End. A lot of traveling these days. Yeah, I try. Huh. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from my computer. <laughs> yeah, it's so amazing. It's shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of hot cargo now. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. Get a good read on. Hmm. Not much to see here. <coughs> Gotta climb up. Get that treasure. <coughs> Is that really... That's it? Huh. Okay, well. If that's it, that's it, you know? Get back in. Was that really necessary? Well, ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. I want to see the March of the Penguins. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest for my Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Are we trying to cross it? Okay. Put the uh, four bucks promising. On. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Don't get stuck on me. Don't you quit on me. Made it. <laughs> I kind of want to just like get off. Get out and shoot these nut chucks. <laughs> uh, one sec. You got something, kid? There you go. Feel better about myself now. <laughs> All right, good to go. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. I just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going. On. Ah! We're good. But everything's good. Jesus Christ. My name's Touch Ninja. I is professional video game driver. The best you guys will ever I'm see out there. <laughs> I'm getting nowhere fast. Oh, gonna have to winch ourselves or, or go around. Shit, shit, shit. Literally in shit right now. Maybe. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. There we go. <laughs> the controls of the driving is actually pretty good for a game that does not focus on vehicles. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. This thing must be built for tough, man. Which way do I go now? Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. <laughs> Yo, it's a Zabumafu. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Why didn't Sam get shotgun? Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road, it might rain, might be muddy. I'll bet we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch. I bet you do use it. Okay. Uh, All right, hang on tight. Follow. Oh, shit. Follow the tire tracks. You take this slow, kid. Yeah. 
Gonna get attacked by a lion. Sense it right now. That would actually pretty... Although, it wouldn't be good for these guys. That actually does Maybe sound pretty sweet. you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... Why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. Come on. Gotta get to the tower. Okay, you guys wait here. Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. How the hell did you get here? Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sigil. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon. Operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. Well, maybe each captain was responsible for a tower, along with providing the men for it. Whatever the case, this certainly isn't our final stop on our tour. That was like a banana. <laughs> the infamous banana artifact. Gonna have to knock down this tree, probably. Yup, yup, yup. Huh. Bark stripped away. Something was wrapped around this tree. The winch is gonna pay for itself right here. Come to me, Wait, baby. Did you know our car came with a winch? No, oh, really? I didn't know. What you gonna do with it? Not sure yet. What you gonna do with all that junk? All that junk inside your trunk? Get it? Trunk? There. I know how to do it. Okay. Now. Here's the fun part. Why do you feel like you need to do that? Alright, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victory. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. I have a very bad feeling that Sully's gonna die. <laughs> I have a very bad feeling. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Look at those Just views. Imagine. You've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. <laughs> oh, poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. I like that there's no clear path exactly. It's taking like forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor, patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. The point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah. Well, still takes a long time. Oh, come on, really? You can make that. It's only have to manually go through this hole right here. Looks hey, like Nathan, check out that cave there. I'll be right back. Hey, you see something? Dynamite. Oh, what the hell? That's not a box to open. More treasure.
I don't know where to go. Where the hell did these guys go? You ready, fellas? Oh. Up this way. That was just look at that. Oh shit. Stop, stop. I see him. Turn off the car. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. You do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. I'd get out of the car, to be honest, but, you know... There actually hasn't been a whole lot of dialogue options. That I expected, like, Mass Effect levels of dialogue options, but... Yes, I was incorrect. Should I get out of the car? Okay. Take the high road first. We'll synchronize the area. Oh shit. Oh shit. Wait. What's that? Ooh, yeah, you have a sniper rifle. I could use a sniper rifle. You ain't Nothing. seen nothing. Nothing, yeah. Give me that gun. Two more. It's a whole lot of guys. Question is, are there any I can't see right now? If I pull you down, will that other guy see me? Most likely. Punch him in the dick! That works. Good stuff. Alright, let's climb the tower. Once we get to the top of the tower, that'll give me a better vantage point of everything to make sure that I can scope out all the people. Oh, what the hell? How the hell did you get up here, Sully? Come on. Exactly what I wanted, but yeah, there is a sniper up here. Oh shit! What the shit? Shit! Was that? Shit! Shit! All right then. What the heck? Straight just chilling. Your asshole before I get sniped. Huh? 
There it is. There's the little bugger. <laughs> what you looking at? Okay. Here we go. Got go no grenades, don't got dynamite. Don't got anything. Here we go. Get the snipe game on. Stand still. In the lag. Oh, shit, man. <laughs> Suck it. They're all dead. Okay. I think that's it. God damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. They, they can just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. That's right. I want that gun. Are those grenades here? This has a red dot. Nice. Nice. Ooh, Rafika. It's like a Modern Warfare 2 style, man. Shoots and bursts. <laughs> Those things are overpowered in Modern Warfare 2. Those guns. Akimbo style. Destroys. Ooh. Looks like I can grapple hook from the car. These pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? The old winch. Pull it down. Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. Why don't we take their armored vehicle? That looks so much better. <laughs> yeah. Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Rafe? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. So Rafe's got the advantage there. All right, cross dissolve. I had to get up for a second because the sun in real life was blinding me in my office. I had to pull a blind. Man, this game. Look how pretty it is. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Singing the same damn thing. But they found the treasure already. Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, you think that old building's worth checking out? Way ahead of you. Ah, hell. Can't jump that high. Problem solved. Genius. Well, 
Hopefully that doesn't attract anyone. <laughs> Another flint lock. More treasure. Okay, I don't understand why the flint. Oh, yeah. Alright, here we go. Sorry, boys. Sorry about the delay. Hey, Sam, you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know. Reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Stimulating Sam, lifestyle. If you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad. Never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it. I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I... I... Check this out. What if that's man-made or natural? Oh, I want you... to me to be half and half. I want to hear the rest so of your story. we're talking about... Uh, yeah. So, I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. He was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go-between. What was he like? Soft-spoken, but intense. Like you could explode at the slightest provocation. <laughs> well, he hasn't changed much then, has he? I got my money and got the hell out of there. So much stuff I just want to explore right now. So, Fire walks into a bar. Okay, here we go. And he's got the steering wheel sticking out of his crotch. All right. So the bartender goes, Hey, man, what's with the wheel? And the pirate says back, Arr, it's driving me nuts. <laughs> oh, God. Ah, I love that one. Don't make me leave you out here. Terrible. Okay, let's go to the man-made, half-man-made cave. Be right back, boys.